<laughs> What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Hi, how are you? Are you ready to glow today? Because today we are going to test out the brand new Fenty Beauty highlighters. There is a liquid one and a puff, literally a puff full of glitter that is allegedly going to make us look mystified and maybe like we're in the Twilight series, but I am very excited for new highlighting products. Anytime there is something glowy on the market, I have to test it out. I know some people are over the highlighting craze. Can't relate. So today we are going to test out everything on my body, and we're also going to go outside and see how it looks in the sun. I know it's snowing in half the country, Ugh. but we do have to get ready for summer, so I am very excited to test these out today. Now, I was in Michigan literally last night, just landed and I grabbed these from Sephora because the PR boxes aren't even sent out yet But bitch, do you think I want to wait to review this? No, I gotta try it right now And I'm meeting tweets all day. Is Fenty Jeffree Star approved? And I'm like, yes, Fenty is, but are the new highlighters? I have no idea. So, if you guys want to see some highlighting action, keep on watching. So the first product, and I have seen this all over Instagram, everyone is talking about it. It is the new Body Lava Body Illuminizer. Now this is a liquid highlighter hybrid. We will go online and see what it is supposed to do exactly before we test it out. And of course we've all seen the viral video of Rihanna turning her shoulder and putting the highlighter right here. So we will definitely test that out and see how it looks today. So we have the liquid highlighter. We also have the brush today, of course. Had to get the brush to try it out. Um, and we also have the Fairy Balm, which I cannot wait to try this. It says it's a glittery pom-pom. So first of all, what are we waiting for? We need to dive in right now. All right, so let's pull out the Body Lava first. Of course, this is the box. Now this has three fluid ounces, so let's take this out. Now this shade is called Who Needs Clothes? I'm fucking living for that name by the way. Bam! Look at how big this bottle is. Now compared to the Fenty Foundation, you can tell there is a definite size comparison. If this looks like my ex, this looks like Nathan. As we can see, Rihanna is a size queen, just like me, and she was not playing when she was giving us a lot of product in this Illuminizer. So, what is the Body Lava supposed to do? Well, first of all, the packaging, let's just talk about that. It's glass, it feels heavy, it feels good, it's solid, it's amazing. Of course, I love all the rose gold accents on everything. The packaging is very out there, and I love that. It says that this is a silky, sublime shimmer, dewy, ultra lit finish. Now, when you go online, this retails for a whopping $59. I was like, oh, damn, baby. But it is um, glass and it is a lot of products. So you're definitely getting your money's worth. Now, there are two shades. The other shade is called Brown Sugar, and it is a more lustrous, um, darker bronze shade. This is a more peachy shade. This is a gel-based body illuminizer made to veil skin in a gloriously dewy, High shine finish for sunlit radiance anytime you please. This is basically gonna give us a glow year round and you can put it anywhere, your cheekbones, your whole body. Um, it says that there are micro pearls blended in here with a sheer tint of color to accentuate all skin tones for a silky sun sun <laughs> You guys, sorry, mom was high. It's gonna give us a sun soaked sheen any time of the year. All right, so Let's dive in here. First of all, it also says that it has an addictive floral vanilla scent, which I live for. Of course, Fenty Beauty is 100% cruelty free, and let's see if we can apply this right now. All right, so you know I had to get the makeup brush as well. Now this is a face and body kabuki brush. It looks like this with the chrome and the baby pink rose bristles. I'm sure this is a synthetic. It definitely feels like it, but it feels like a soft, synthetic, not rough or cheap. It definitely feels really nice. All right, so the box says that it is a custom angle design for face and body, effortless blending for liquid and powder formulas. Okay, now this brush retails for $34, and of course it is for everything. It's for the highlighting products, obviously, and let's get this started. Let's try it out, you guys. So let's turn this way. Let's channel our Rihanna. We're gonna take off the lid, and you get this pump right here. Now, Rihanna used a lot, and I'm gonna use a lot because I'm a highlighting queen. So, first of all, before we even use the brush, I gotta touch it, you guys. Let's touch it for a second. We have to. Oh, wow. It's like oily. Okay. Oh. 
Bitch, I'm hungry. Woo! Oh my god, that is yummy. Okay, I'm gonna rub this on my hand real quickly. Ooh, 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 it looks high shine. Okay, see, there it is on my hand. Rubbing it in. Okay. Oh, wow. It's definitely, like, very oil-based. It's, like, uh, sleek. Okay, let's do the brush first because that's what we're here for. Let's turn to the side and let's see what happens, everybody. Oh, wow, it's glistening. Now the brush works very quickly. As you see, it is synthetic, so it's really not gonna soak up the product. It is gonna move it around nice and quickly. So let's just move it up top. So there's how it looks. Now, of course, I am in the studio, so we will go outside in a minute and see how this looks with pure sun shining on my body. But for now, this is how it looks in the studio. Now you guys know I like to turn on my phone and turn on the flashlight. So let's see what this looks like. <gasps> Ooh, girl, look at that. Shine bright like my pussy. Let's do a few more pumps, shall we? Let's do, let's just cover Michelle Pfeiffer. What's up, Catwoman? Yes, girl. How about right in the mouth? Girl, I love it. Right in my mouth. Okay, so let's put it all over our bodies. Oh, wow. It's like so satisfying to watch it blend out. Mm. Okay, wow. Well, that went on very easy. Let me stand up a little bit. You can definitely see the shine right away. Okay, wow. Now, I'm gonna put on a little more. I know this is kind of hard to do because I can't see myself, but go big or go home, right? Hi, I have a mirror. Duh! You can definitely see it covering over my tattoos. It looks very luminous. It is definitely pretty, like, mm, yes, girl. I feel like I just want to coat my whole body in this. You think Nate will do it? <laughs> Coating my entire body in body lava. All right, you guys, wow. Okay, so you can definitely see it has that slick type of look. It is very glistening and it looks really pretty. Now, I don't know how it feels yet. Let's let it dry for a minute and then we'll see how it feels. So let's put the cap on that for a second. And now let's move on to the Fairy Balm. Bam, here is the Fairy Balm. This is a glittering pom-pom and the packaging looks like this. I love it. It's very bam. Now this says it is a plush, shimmer-packed puff. Instant body glitz. All right, so let's open it. It comes with the sleeve thing on it. Okay, it looks like that. Now it does, of course, come sealed. I already took my nail and I went shing. So <laughs> let's open this up. Oh, wow. All right, so once you pull it off, the puff is already like bam, it's there. Wow, smells amazing. Okay, so here is what it looks like. Now let's pull it out. It does have this little moment here. So, damn, that's big. Look at compared to my face. Mm-hmm. I just wanna like get teabagged right now. I'm like, haha. Okay, so let's go on the website and see what this is supposed to do. Okay, this is an oversized glittery puff pre-packed with super fine 3D rose gold shimmer designed for dabbing directly all over the body. How do we do, how do we apply this? Let's see. This shade is called Rose on Ice. So this is smelling like vanilla coconut, it says, and we're just gonna put this on this side of the body and then we'll see. I don't think you're supposed to layer it. It does not say put over this, so we're just gonna try it by itself. So let's just take it. I don't know how much shimmer is supposed to come out. Let's just try my hand first, I guess, and let's just see what happens, you guys. I'm like, are you supposed to hit yourself? Or is it just supposed to like shimmy all over? <gasps> oh, okay, I see it. I definitely see it. All right, so I'm, it says to dab it all over. We're dabbing. Oh, it's really light. Like it's very, it's sheer. I think it's sheer. All right, let's look. I did a lot on my arm, so let's do the flashlight test. It might be really hard to see in the studio, you guys. We will step outside in a second, but... Oh, okay, Let's, we're gonna zoom in on my hand. It's definitely there, it's just a little more sheer than I guess I thought it was gonna be. I, I didn't know what to expect, but yeah, it's definitely there, it's just, it's sheer. So let's take the puff again and let's... Oh yeah, it's really sheer. Compared to the body lava, it is definitely sh like way sheer. So let's take this. All right, so we're gonna zoom in on the tattoos. You can definitely tell that it's a you know way more fainter than the other one, but it is pretty. It smells really good. I think I'm just fucking hungry and have the munchies. <laughs> um, all right, I'm gonna put on a little bit more because I really want us to get the full effect when we go outside. You just definitely have to like do another layer and pack it on, I think. So let's do that. Okay, it's showing up more now. Maybe it also has to be activated, you guys. Like it's been sitting in its box for a second. It needs to like have its moment. There we go. All right, so we will do that. There is that. And then this arm over here is looking bare. Guys, I can't stop. Body lava me. 
All right, my arms are completely covered. Wow, it definitely has like that wet look. Now, I have not touched my chest yet. My fingers are clean. Since we just applied the fairy balm over here, I wanna touch and see how the body lava is doing. So it's been about five minutes and let's see. Oh wow, it is sticky. Like definitely came off um, and it feels really tacky. Like something would definitely stick to my skin like quickly, you know what I mean? So okay, we'll give it another five minutes and see how it feels, but let's go outside and see what this looks like in the daylight. All right, you guys, I'm in the direct sun. It's a little hard to open up my eyes, but I want you guys to see the real accuracy of this review. So, excuse my star shadow, but here is the body lava all right here. Wow, it's definitely wet looking. It's very bam. Let's turn, you can see my arm. Oh, wow. That looks crazy on tattoos. It looks so stunning. Wow. So let's turn my body over here to the fairy balm. Now I'm actually a little shocked and shook because why does this look so pretty in the daylight? But in the studio it was a little diffused and I was like, where is it? Outside I'm like, oh, hello. It's like very pretty. It's very shimmery. I'm actually gonna take some right now and do a little more. So I'm just gonna dab a little bit more on. Wow. You can see the glitter particles in the sunlight and it looks really, really pretty. I'm like, wow. Definitely shocked because I was a little unimpressed in the studio, but now that I'm out here, I'm like, bitch, okay. Now, the only thing is this has been on for about 20 minutes now, you guys, and it is really tacky, like stick. So, let's go inside and give our final thoughts, but you guys, what do we think so far? I'm like, damn. Let's give our final thoughts on this review. So, going outside definitely changed my mind about the fairy bomb. At first, I was like, girl. But outside, it was like, oh, like, definitely could see it. So, when you're in front of a bunch of beauty lights, sometimes things can look a little different. So, I'm glad I went outside. It's still, yeah, in the studio, the glitter is not like really, really powerful. Even with the light, I wasn't living and breathing for it. But outside, it is stunning. So if you're about to go to a pool party, if you're about to lay out and just smoke one on the beach, it's it's a moment. All right, now let's talk about the body lava. Um, oh, hey. <laughs> oh, perfect. Okay, you guys, Nate, come here. He has no idea what's happening. All right, so I'm reviewing the, the new Rihanna stuff. Oh, I'll, yeah? I'll scoot over. You good. All right, so only thing. I'm about to give my final thoughts. Now this one was really cute. Look at this. Smell it. Hmm. It smells pretty good. Let me see your hand. See the glitter is really fine. Oh wow. Yeah. Doing the a little sparkles. flashlight test. It sparkles. The sparkles. Um, okay. So anyway, this one is what we're about to do the final thoughts on. And okay. to me, touch my chest and tell me how you'd feel if you're hugging me if that was covering me. Oh wow. What does it feel like to you? That's like really sticky. It's really sticky, huh? So that's my only complaint. Like, I just that, can't. Yeah, that like pulled on the skin almost. <laughs> yeah. You... So if you're gonna go outside and do a photo shoot or just not have any guy touch you, this would definitely be a very cute luminizer. Here, touch the touch cat woman. But it's really sticky, so I couldn't imagine trying to lay next to Nathan or yeah. like rub on him because it would like be kind of yeah, maybe messy. Yeah, I couldn't messy. imagine what that would feel like once it gets wet either if you were to like jump in the water or something. Ooh. I bet you would get like super. Let me see your hand. Like, I'm just gonna pretend if you like touch me for a second. Oh, oh yeah, yeah your, all... hand, your hand's wet. Oh yeah, it's all over. Uh huh. So to me, I love the effect. It looks so stunning, but I couldn't imagine covering myself with it and then going to the beach. Like I think sand would just. Oh yeah, you. you'd you'd get covered in sand. <laughs> yeah, so definitely good for Instagram pictures. And uh, if you're just living your life and at the poolside, not near any sand or dirt. <laughs> all right, baby, love you. Love you baby. I got gloss on. That's all right. Mm-hmm. If you don't wear liquid lip, men are not into that lip gloss. All right, so the final verdict is the Fenty Beauty Fairy Balm. Definitely really cute. I liked it a lot. Um, you guys know I was a little nervous at first, but it is really pretty. I want to put this over. No, we can't. Because what if it gets... Mm, it might get wet on here and I don't want, I don't want to ruin it. Oh, it smells so pretty. I'm like, hi. Moving on, the face and body brush. It was cute. I don't personally use brushes that come with products. I think we already own so many brushes. It's like, come on girl. But 
brands always do that. So it's definitely a cute accessory if you're someone that likes to collect. Definitely love putting little brushes on my vanity. The brush worked, it was great. Um, did an amazing job. And bam, look at I am glistening. All right, so the body lava, you guys, I'm on the fence. I'm not sure about it, only because of how it doesn't dry down. I think it just feels a little too tacky for my taste, so I will not be wearing this if I'm going to the beach. But if I'm just going to the pool and hanging out, I will give my chest a little moment. Um, so I'm on the fence, you guys. What do you think? All right, so the Fenty Beauty Face and Body Kabuki Brush and the Fairy Bomb are Jeffree Star approved. But I am a little on the fence here, you guys. I don't want to disapprove this because it looks amazing on the skin, but with how it dried down, I cannot say I 100% live for it myself, but I want you guys to sound off below, so we're not gonna disapprove and we're not gonna approve. So for now, it is gonna stay in the middle, and I wanna hear what you guys think. What type of formula do you guys love, and what would you wear, or would you even wear it? So, besides that, you guys, Fenty Beauty is on a roll from packaging to aesthetic to how they present the new products. I am living for it, and I cannot wait to see what is next. All right, you guys, thank you for watching this review. I will see you on the next one. Bye, guys.